Hey there, I'm Steve Avery. For those that don't have the Netflix show, i done been convicted twice, once of the rape and assault, and then another time for the murder. I didn't do nothing, but this ain't even about me. It's about all the folks in Manitowoc County who've been charged with things they didn't do. So maybe you should talk to some of them, some of them folks. Hi there, name's Norm Malone. I used to drive bus for Manitowoc County over Lincoln High. Go ships. Uh, I was uh, just washing the bus up on my last day before retirement, and uh, the little boy used to know Freddy, Freddy Snyder. He's now Manitowoc County Sheriff. He comes on over to the yard and says, hey, hey Norm, you want to go for a walk? And I'm like, oh, well, why not? I don't know the boys since he's in short pants. Thought we'd catch up on a little bit of Packers. So come on back before you know it. I'm arrested for having 80 keys of black tar heroin lining the wheels of the school bus. I don't remember doing nothing like that, but they said I did, so I guess it must have done. So there I am, just scrapbooking away. I hear a knock on the door. It's Detective Link. I said, hey, Detective Link. I said, hey, Charlie, why don't you go and see if there's anything going on in the backyard? I said, I don't think there's anything going on back there. But I opened the door, and sure enough, there's a rare crimson crested finch. I said, oh, golly, I better grab my binocs. That's some good bird viewing. Next thing you know, I'm being handcuffed and taken down to the station for running a child pornography ring out of my garage. You did it. No, I didn't do it. You did it. Am I gonna get home in time to watch my shows? If you say you did it, you'll get home in time for Scandal. Okay, fine, I did it. I mean, look, if you're dumb, poor, or an Avery, and you live in Manitowoc County, we'll pretty much find something to pin on you. Yeah. Hey, what's that camera doing right there? Pictures, right? Cool. My name is Carol Kishner. I've been here about uh, two years there, out of five. Uh, one day I was dropping my kids off at school, they go to this great charter school, when suddenly the police were swarming me and said that I was getting caught for running a pit bull fighting ring in my basement. Now I've never met the man, I've never even heard his music, but if he's up to no good on my property, then lock me up and throw away the key. They were like, you're going down, and I was like, timber! <laughs> Well, I'm Alan Skaletsky, and I've uh, been one of the bad boys of B-Block here since 09. They got me locked up for being a serial strangler. Now, how my fingerprints got on the necks of all those poor dead gals, I'll never know, because I was born with no hands, you see. But I don't want to step on anybody's toes. You can imagine how much respect I have for those. So I'm doing my time, keeping my mouth shut, because the cops, they put a lot of time and money into this investigation, and you got to respect what they do. But that is a tough job. There you have it. So next time you think you see a murder, then might not, it might have been made into one. <laughs>